celebration matters because it's an opportunity we have to thank the audience, thank the fans, you know. This, this journey has been amazing because of their support, their love, you know. Uh, it helps you. It, the, the, it's a long ride, you know. And since day one, I remember like seven years ago we were here. And uh, since day one, they're there to cheer you up, to tell you how much what you're doing matters to them. And that's, that's, that just happens with Star Wars, you know. And I, I was really happy today to be able to... to give back a little to, to these people, you know, and uh, to make sure they understand we're working really hard and season two matters a lot to us and we, we just want to make sure they love it as much as they, they did with season one. It's been so exciting. I think when we, when we come to these things, sometimes you're promoting something and I think for us specifically as Andor, people have already watched the show and we're meeting fans after they've already watched the show, which is rare, you know, for us to experience that. So that's been really special and to see the excitement and the applause means that they like it. And you're just like, oh, my God, this I'm, I'm a part of something so special. We really do this for the fans. I mean, we wouldn't have a show if it weren't to be for them. I wouldn't have a job. I wouldn't be playing Bix if it weren't to be for them. So to get to see and feel the excitement that that something that you're creating in collaboration is bringing is just I mean it really doesn't get it doesn't get better than that it's really interesting sort of the format of this season and I think that's I I personally have never been in anything like that and I've never I've never worked in that format sort of like the the time jumps that happen throughout sort of the season and in a way you'll get to see different versions of every character and you're kind of see how they grow and how they've dealt with situations that you've seen happen before. It's so thrilling to be here in my hometown and uh, just the energy is kind of, you know, it's palpable in the room. They're just people so excited, so much passion, bouncing back and forth between, you know, the panel and, and, and everyone listening and watching. And it's just, it, I, I, it's just a, gr it is a great celebration. and. You realise how many people Star the Star Wars universe has brought together over the years, over you know decades, and now all these new iterations with the new series, driving younger viewers back towards the originals as well. It's, it's this big cycle of life, which is which you just feel the passion in the room. You could just feel the excitement. You could just feel the thrill kind of rippling through the audience. Uh, they're ripe and ready for it. And uh, I think I think the fact of the matter is, you know, Andor was such a it's so well received because it's such a powerful piece of drama, you know, real drama and, and, and with such complex and emotional characters. So to see how that is, is, is the way it's going to go forth into the, into the next iteration it was, and to see their reaction to it was, was excellent. We're right in the middle of season two, of filming season two right now. Um, and so when you're filming, it feels like you're in a little bit of a isolated or protective bubble you know you're you're working away you're kind of crafting your your head is um, in character but also in work we're around studios so to come here today to step outside of that for a minute and to to see the people that it means so much to it, it really feels special to to be able to have been able to see that love today and that passion Andor season one really set up all the characters, it set up the world, it set up um, the, each of the characters ideals, also their drive and also their own personal sacrifices and that's what we really delve into in season two. It was like being welcomed home like in the most <laughs> incredible in, intense way. It was like a, a family festival and um, it's been amazing to come back with the reception of Andor already being out and it being so warmly received and and seeing firsthand still what it means to fans you know and I, it just is a huge injection of energy to finish season two in the best possible way for them and um, yeah I, like today has been wild it's been really great it's amazing to see it again you know I mean when you're filming you kind of maybe forget what it looks like and you can watch things back if you want but I don't really 
And then seeing that cut together, you just go like, oh my God, yeah, this is Star Wars. I'm in Star Wars. This is so cool. We went last year to Anaheim, and we were just a secret, weird thing that people had heard about, and what was it, and what were they doing, and we didn't really, we hadn't shown it to anybody anywhere, and so we kind of was, we kind of felt like we were just sort of surfing through the event last time and marveling at, now it's really, you know, these are our people now. This is our this is our this is our audience. This is our thing. What am I most excited? There's so many things. I I guess um, I really want them to feel that we stick the landing. I mean, really. I you know it's it's sort of graphing onto the question before, but I really want to feel like I want to feel like we honored the uh, you know there's some canonical things that happened in this five year period that we're responsible for. Uh, I want the I want that audience in, in in that room that really cares the most to feel like we've been, uh, you know, proper and reverential and careful with with the property. At the same time, I want to we really want to stick the landing.